and now we're going to clean up our brushes because we need to clean our brushes between coats. So what we're going to do is, traditionally, uh, painters do a three rinse uh, to clean brushes, whether it be oil-based or water-based, whatever your medium is. In this case, uh, Sickens is an oil-based product, so we are going to use a mineral spirits to clean. So we have our first rinse, and you want to make sure to really push all the way down the brush to get it all the mineral spirits all the way up into the barrel here and get it real clean. And then what we do after we do that is we get it clean, and then we spin it to have the centrifugal force, force all the material out like that. Okay, so that's the first rinse there. Now, since we go, went ahead and used all the Cetol 1, and there's none left in there, we're just going to use this bucket as our empty. It's super important that you take this stuff. Uh, we're going to cap that up, and afterwards we'll add it to our collection, and eventually it will be taken to a hazardous waste center here in Austin. So it's super important that you get rid of all this stuff uh, correctly. Uh, you can't just go pulling the stuff out at all. That's just... Uh, uh, not the way to handle this stuff. And so you want to take this to a hazardous waste center. So after I get my first rinse, I'm going to go ahead and clean up my bucket a little bit to make sure it's real clean. Then I'm going to go ahead and put uh, some more mineral spirits in. Don't have to fill it up by any means, just uh, maybe a couple inches there in the bottom. And then we're going to do the same thing again. We're going to go ahead and really uh, rinse this thing out like this. Because these brushes need to be ultra clean when you're done with them. And ultra soft because they're used for oil based finishes and stuff. They can't be at all stiff. They have to leave behind a really nice finish, whether it's varnish or high gloss oil paint. And so, and me, I prefer white china bristle. I just think they're softer. I just like them more. So that is our second rinse there. You can see it's a little bit cloudy. Okay, and I'm going to take a rag. I'm going to go ahead and rinse this out again, just a little bit more, just clean it out a little bit more. Anything worth doing, worth doing right. We're going to do our third rinse. Okay, a couple inches in there. Same thing. And you can see this one is will have a tiny bit thinner, but basically clean. And that is what you want. After you get these done, you're going to want to put them in their container so they maintain their shape. Pour that out. Okay. Put some rags in there. Clean that out. Drop these brushes in here so we get them wrapped. Cap up our mineral spirits. Make sure we cap this well for disposal later. And that's it. That's how you clean up.